today I am finally going to try and solve and finish once and for all this whole wiring issue. So like I said, we're going to switch out those Deutsch connectors for the standard 14 pin skid steer uh, connectors, electrical connector. All these parts were supplied to me by fridayparts.com. Now I got this wiring diagram from Balmolite that I'm gonna try and follow. The, the colors don't really correspond, but I think we should be able to figure it out. So you can see these are all labeled and B right there is the ground. So that's, that's where we're going and they're labeled on the inside too. So we're gonna take the black and go uh, go to B. I got this little tool. All right, that's, that's in there now. See the pin coming out that side and it's, it's locked in there. You can kind of feel it click. So now we got all these pins in here. I'm not sure if they're in the exact proper location, but we'll figure it out. All right, so we're loosely attached here. I just want to see that it works and uh, then we can tighten everything up. So we're just doing a little test run here. And as you can see on my joystick, I have a button that was installed on the back to control the diverter valve. And when you push this button, it's going to allow the diverter valve on the grapple to divert flow from the open and close function to the rotate left and right function. Um, so as you can see here, when I'm not touching that back button, I can hit this right button and the grapple opens up. I don't know if you can see that. And as I hit the left button, it closes. And now I'm gonna push the back button and push the right button and it rotates and it rotates. So I think we have it figured out.